what will stand out most to you when you think back to that ninth inning and how it developed and how it ended? Um, just our competitiveness. Um, you know, we've been through a lot this year. Um, but the one thing I'm most proud of with these guys is is they always compete. And, you know, the Gary at bat, I think, is a great example of that. I mean, if you fall behind 0-2 against that guy, lay off some tough pitches, battle, battle, and just miss winning the game. Um, it was a great at bat. Um, but just proud of the way they competed. Um, it just really sucks. Came up short. Uh, Barry, we'll get you the mic. Uh, after the events of last night, what was your thoughts on keeping CeCe in the game as balls are hitting, being hit harder and harder against him? I, w I was fine with with the way CeCe was throwing the ball. You know, he, he was at the two-out point. Um, we were going to have him go through Bradley. Simple as that. You just kind of knew we had our guys lined up enough that we could, especially had we got to that point, we could we could get through the game. Uh, I, I think it was a sound sound decision to move him, allow him to go through Bradley at that point. Other questions? Uh, Ryan, we'll catch you the mic. Aaron, it's uh, it's always. Uh, a little surprising when you guys don't hit here, especially. How, how shocking was it to see the way your offense was shut down, not once but twice in this building? Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, definitely frustrating. And, and, you know, I think one of their goals in this series was to keep us in the ballpark. And and then coming here, um, where we're so good at that, they were able to do it. And, you know, credit to them for being able to hold us down and shut us down. Um, but I mean, in the end, you know, you don't move on usually when you don't, you can't get those enough big hits in a series and, and they, they just outplayed us a little bit. Other questions? Uh, Ryan. Aaron, is there anything about the makeup or identity of the offense that, Results in not being able to get the big hit that is something you guys are going to have to take a look at? Well, we want to continue to get better. Um, so we're chasing the perfect offense. So, um, you know, as a major league athlete, we're, we're chasing to be the best we can be. Um, and unfortunately it wasn't it wasn't good enough and we'll continue to work um at, at getting to that point where we're as cl complete in every department as we can be offensively pitching defense um but you're always chasing utopia you know you're we're chasing that uh, ken in the second row aaron just to clarify with that third inning you said you resolved the cc was going to get through bradley uh, as he got the second out that that's when you yeah. yeah. So three more bat. The two. Um, gosh, you gotta take me back now. Um, Kinsler got the. Uh, Kinsler got hit the, the ball, and then Nunez. Nunez got the single. Right. So. And then who was? Uh, and then Bradley. Right? Yeah. Yeah. So once, you know, had he gotten Nunez, you know, it might have been the end of his night. But once Nunez got the hit, we weren't going to go to the pen there. We were going to let him face Bradley, uh, the lefty there. Well, I guess the question is, how seriously do you consider? What things did you see earlier, you know, before Kinsler, before Nunez? Yeah, um, not not serious at that point. I mean, we obviously we had a, we had um, we had Robbie up there, but um, no, not at that point. We we're a, a hitter away. Uh, Tyler, Aaron, when you talk about ch uh, chasing the perfect offense and being more complete, what kind of things would you like to see more? What do you think the offense needs more going forward? Well, I mean, you're always chasing to be a, the most complete hitter you can be, to be, you know, to be the best base running team. I mean, I, I mean, that's, we're chasing greatness here. And, I mean, that's better in every aspect, better at getting on base, you know, better at slugging, better at putting the ball in play, all those things that, 
that you work on as a hitter to be the best you can be. Do four more, starting with Mark on your right. Aaron, understanding you were comfortable with CC in the third at that point, did you see anything change with him from that, you know, from maybe those last three or four hitters? Um, obviously, Kinsler smoked the ball. I think Gardy got a little turned around there. Um, and then Nunez hit the ball hard, but felt good about him facing Bradley for the last hitter there. And then it would have been, had he not gotten through there, it would have been Robbie. Um, once he did get through, we wanted Britain to start that next inning and go through the top of their order. Uh, three more, Danny. Aaron, in each of the four games of the series, the team that had the better starting pitching performance won. Mm -hmm. Is your rotation good enough to win a championship? Yeah. I mean, it, you know, now going forward, what's our rotation going to be? Obviously, we have some some decisions. A lot of things are going to happen between, obviously, now and next year. Um, but I think we're right there knocking on the door to be that yes i mean i think we're very close to being a championship club right now you know we just gotta continue to improve on the margins in, in every facet um pitching is one of those uh mark carrick and you mentioned them keeping you guys in the park do you think that's a matter of execution just ebb and flow or is there something fundamentally about the type of players you guys need to target to be you know, maybe more complete or you know I guess what part of that do you think rose to sort of keep you guys in the park well I think one is execution I think they did a really good job of uh, game planning you know executing for the most part um, uh, I mean I, I I mean I don't know do we need to be better of course obviously um, but I mean, I don't know how to answer that question as far as it wasn't good enough. So we need to be better. Simple as that. Um, as far as targeting, I mean, that's that's for the winner. And, you know, as as the roster changes and adds and subtracts and those kind of things, and, and hopefully we'll continue to work towards having the most complete team we, we can. We'll finish up with John in the third row. Aaron, how would you characterize Stanton's series? He had a lot of chances in big spots for you. Yeah, I mean, he, he threw some hits out there. Um, you know, a little little up and down, had some good at-bats. Um, you know, got on base a little bit. Um, obviously had some chances. Um, you know, that, you know some, some chances where he could have made a big difference with a big hit or, or whatever, and, and it just didn't happen in this series. And, you know, that's... That's part of it, but, you know, that's also why we have nine guys. Um, it's not all about one guy, and um, we just weren't able to get enough. Aaron, thanks for everything, and we appreciate it. Yeah, thank you.